Hi folks, Mark here, Views from Mark. Welcome to this episode two of Operation Exploding Pen, where I'm documenting my journey with this book, Daniel Craig's Bond by Greg Williams, where I'm trying to get some signatures of the key individuals associated not just with this book, but with the Bond franchise in general. So if you haven't seen episode one yet, I thoroughly recommend that you check that out where I was trying to get the signatures of the producers of the films, Barbara Broccoli and Michael G. Wilson. But in this episode, episode two, I'm on the tracks of Mr. Reynold Ashleyman, who is the president and CEO of Amiga Watches. He's also the gentleman that actually gifted me this copy of the book. But Amiga were instrumental in the creation of this book, so it seemed apt that I try and get Reynold to sign it when he was in London. So this episode didn't exactly turn out as I had planned when I first started thinking about how I was going to go about getting Reynolds' signature, but it was a great result nonetheless. So let's just skip ahead to the mission briefing and get on with this episode. <music> Hi folks, Mark here, Views from Mark as always. I hope you're keeping safe, healthy and are well. Today you join me in a very special location as you can probably tell. I'm in the Amiga Her Time exhibit where they currently have an exhibition of all the ladies watches that date back right back to the turn of the century, right up to the modern day, ahead of an event that is taking place this evening where they're going to be launching a brand new watch at the time of recording this video and they have all the new Aquatiera watches that are on display. Now, I'm down in London today for Operation Exploding Pen episode two, and this is quite different because I had a plan and a preconceived idea of how I was gonna go about this. However, things have taken a very rapid turn and we're going with the flow and adapting as we go. So, shortly after receiving the signatures of both Barbara Rockley and Michael G. Wilson at Eon Productions, I set my mind to trying to hunt down Mr. Reynold Ashleman, who is the CEO of Amiga, to see if I could get him to sign my book, as well as Greg Williams and Daniel Craig further down the line. Now I had heard through a contact that Reynold was perhaps gonna be in London, middle of March, for this event that's taking place today. So I thought, well, I'll draft an email and send it across to see if there is any way that there could be a meeting in person to, just to get him to sign the, the book, really. And I wanted a second opinion on that email, so I sent it over the draft email to my good friend, Matthew Gibbs, AKA Commander Bond underscore 007, just to see what he thought and to see if there was anything that he would add. I kid you not, within 20 minutes I had a reply and he said, the email sounds great, however, I wouldn't send it just yet because I have been in touch with Reynolds people about meeting up anyway to get his own copy of the book signed. So I thought, okay, well, we'll see what comes of that. Fast forward to yesterday, Tuesday 21st of March, I believe it was, I had a, a message from Matthew to say that yes, they've come back to us and said we can meet Reynold if we can be in London for 8.30 a.m. at his hotel to meet him in person and he will sign the book. So I thought, fantastic, I will definitely do that. I'll head down to London. So at 6 a.m. this morning, I headed down to London, left my house, headed down to London. Here I am now, I arrive at his hotel and it wasn't just a case of Reynold shows up, signs the book and then disappears into the ether. No, 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 no. He sat down with us, he spent 35 minutes, 40 minutes with us both, having a coffee, having a chat, having a great discussion about all things Amiga, Bond, the book, how it came to be, etc. It was really unexpected that we got so much time face to face with Reynold that he would take that time out of his very busy day, to be fair, because obviously they've got this marvelous event that's taking place this evening that they're setting up for, but he did. And not only that, he gave us a personal invitation to come across the road to this magnificent building to see the Omega Her Time exhibition. And we were given a guided tour around the entire exhibition by Anthony of the Bond Street Store, who was wonderful, going through the history of the ladies' watches from the very start right up to the modern day, ahead of tonight's event. So it could not have been any more special, any more magical. And of course, the big question is, did I get Reynolds to sign the book? Yes, Reynold was incredibly gracious. He loved flicking through the book. 
seeing all the images again and he did indeed sign it. So I'm gonna flip up on the screen now, the newly signed book. Right underneath Barbara and Michael's signatures, we have Mr. Reynold Ashleyman, CEO of Amiga, who was so instrumental and integral to getting this book produced with Greg Williams. So that means the next person on my list is of course, Greg Williams. Before Daniel Craig, because I think he's gonna be the hardest person to pin down, it's gonna be Greg Williams. So this has been a very different episode to what I envisaged. There was so much with the conversation with Reynold where we were talking about the No Time to Die special edition and everything about this bracelet, the difference between the version one and the version which is now available but it has been a truly magical, wonderful, special day. I can't begin to tell you. I wanna extend a heartfelt thanks to Matthew Gibbs for arranging this. As I say, I wasn't expecting him to, but he was already on the mission to, to meet with Reynold as well. Thank you to him for letting me tag along and thank you to Reynold, Amiga, all the guys here, the staff, you know, that I know already from the London boutiques but also some of the international staff that have flown over, especially for today's event. It's been, you know, I'm not going to the official event, I'm here ahead of that, but it's wonderful. That's it. Episode two of Operation Exploding Pen is complete. I'm gonna drink a glass of champagne and celebrate. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please do consider giving it a thumbs up, a like, hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you get a notification whenever I post something new, but, I mean, as I say, this is an unexpected video. It's not how I planned it to go, but I hope it's been enjoyable for you. It certainly has for me. And until the next time, as always, stay safe, stay healthy, stay well, and I'll catch you all very soon. Cheers. Righty.